I'm Nicole Gomez and this is your morning update for Tuesday, June 15th. California was the first state in the nation to lock down due to COVID-19. And now, more than a year later, it's finally lifting almost all restrictions. As of today, the color-coded system is gone, and there are no more state-mandated restrictions on capacity at businesses or in-person gatherings. Masks are no longer required in most public places either, but there are still some situations where you might need one. That includes public transportation, planes, trains, and taxis. You'll also need to wear one in healthcare settings and at schools. Some businesses may choose to still require masks as well. Well, now to our vaccine progress here in San Diego. We have the second highest number of vaccinations in the state right after LA County. More than 75% of eligible San Diegans are at least partially vaccinated. That's more than 2.1 million people. More than 1.7 million are fully vaccinated. Well, 10 vaccinated lucky Californians will win $1.5 million today in a drawing. According to the state tracker, 22.4 million Californians have at least one dose of the vaccine. So that means your chances of winning are slim, just about one in 2.2 million. The state also announced some new incentives. A drawing will be held July 1st for six California vacation packages. That sounds nice. San Diego city leaders have decided on a plan to spend $4.6 billion over the next fiscal year. City Council unanimously passed Mayor Todd Gloria's proposed budget last night with millions for infrastructure and other investments. The budget creates a new Homelessness Strategies Department, which will focus on addiction treatment, outreach and housing programs. One of the more controversial decisions, the budget does increase the police department's overall funding by $23 million. San Diego County is going to experience some serious heat today and all week. NBC7 meteorologist Sheena Parveen says the county is in store for some record-breaking heat with some areas reaching in the triple digits. Power operators are not expecting any rolling outages because of the heat, but sdg &E recommends conserving energy if you can. Don't turn on any of those big appliances between four and nine. And to beat the heat, several cool zones are open across the county today through Friday. So take a look at your screen. Maybe if you don't have AC, you can go here. These are cool zones in libraries in Alpine, Borrego Springs, Ramona, and more. You can also cool off at the community centers in Lakeside, Fallbrook, and Spring Valley. Well, we'll continue to bring you the latest news here on NBC7.com and on TV. You can also learn more on our podcast today in San Diego, where we talk about the day's biggest headlines and those affecting our community. Stay safe and have a great day.